All right, Colby, I mean, uh, first game of the season here, first win of the season here. I mean, great day. Yeah, for sure. You know, coach did a great job uh, getting us ready, prepared for this game. Did a great job on the scouting report. We knew our uh, job and our, what we had to do to win this game, and we executed. <laughs> Offensively, I mean, uh, got off to a hot start there. I really both had there. I mean, uh, getting a... 8-2 run there to start the game, and then 7-0, especially right after they hit a buzzer beater at the second half. Talk about how big was it to really uh, you know, get a good start there in that second half and really take all control back there. Uh, you know, Coach really uh, got us pumped up in the locker room, got us ready, you know, and we had to come out firing. The football mentality, you know, be physical in the paint, just own the boards, go down, just execute offensively and uh, run everything correct. Speaking of coach there, I mean, had to feel good to give him his uh, first win here as a Titan. Oh, yeah, I felt great, you know. It's a great thing uh, to have a coach like that and get his first win for him. So, Colby, great. talk talk to me about your guys' defense tonight. Uh, pretty hounding all night long. Just just talk about kind of the game plan coming in and how you guys executed it. Uh, yeah, coach really uh, emphasized locking people up, being help side, making sure we're straight up, not uh, making any stupid fouls and coming down and keeping yourself in the game. So... You guys were able to find a lot of success tonight on the pick and roll. Just talk about that chemistry you have with your guards. Um, you know, we work a lot in practice and try to get that chemistry, sorry, chemistry. get chemistry in practice, you know, work, work with one another, know if you're throwing a high, low bounce pass. <laughs> so that really went well. And you guys are 1-0 and now, obviously a, a big win to uh, to start the Hawkeye 10 season. Just talk about what you, what kind of the goals are for this team and how you guys are going to work to uh, Just that. one game at a time, work really hard, practice, just – Try to take one game at a time and uh, work really hard. We'll see right. where we end up. Thanks, Colby. Congrats. Thank you. Here with Coach Ricky Torres of uh, Lewis Central. Coach, 60-29 victory over Red Oak tonight. Your first one as a Titan. Just tell me how it felt. Uh, it's kind of unreal. Uh, just uh, the whole you know, interview process, and then you work all summer long with the guys, and you're really excited to get going, and then all of a sudden, you know, they had a heck of a football season. So then it was like a, an adjustment for me. Uh, to start practice a little bit later, but uh, kudos to Coach Camrad and the guys uh, in football. But overall, uh, it's, uh, it's an unreal moment for sure. Talk about what you liked from your team's performance tonight. Uh, it's the biggest thing that you know you can always look at all the little things that go into it, but just the defensive pride that our guys took. You know, in the second half, they ended up with 11 points in the second half, which kind of changed the game tremendously. Uh, the guys locked in on the game plan and uh, executed very well. Especially after that buzzer beater that they hit right before the half end there. I mean, just talk about how big it was to come out there. I mean, 7 0 run right out of the gate from there. I mean, really just seized all momentum back at that point. I, you know, basketball is a game of runs where all of a sudden there, there's going to be things that happen. All of a sudden a guy gets hot or something like that, but it's how you adjust to those things that make the difference in the game. And, you know, kudos to Red Oak, well coached, and the DeVries kid made a nice shot. And, um, he's a heck of a player, but. Uh, I think our guys uh, figured out what were some of the things that were happening to them, bought into it, and kept guys in front. You guys are defensively suffocating tonight. Is that is that kind of going to be a calling card of this team as the season goes on? Oh, uh, definitely. For the you know majority of the year, we're going to definitely really buy into the defensive end until our shot comes. You know, with us starting later and different things like that, and then confidence. You know, if you look at this varsity roster, you know, there's a lot of guys that don't have a whole lot of varsity experience, which is, you know, scary good at, at the other part of it because they buy in so much on the defensive end. And then it's also scary because you never know who's going to go off that. Yeah, Coach, uh, j just talk about, you know, Colby Souther down low, a uh, pretty big presence. Just talk about what he brings to the table. Uh, Colby Souther, he's, he's a man. Uh, if you <laughs> look at him as a full-grown man and he works his tail off, uh, he had a really great summer. Uh, he even – Went out for football that really helped him with his physical presence inside, you know, playing at defensive end. Um, he, and he's just one of those guys that always is trying to learn. He's always trying to improve. He's always trying to figure out how can I make myself, you know, better for my team and uh, be a force to reckon with. Obviously, the season is still pretty young here, and uh, everybody wants to get to the state tournament and such. But I mean, what are some goals this team has here as you move along with the season here? Uh, definitely, you know, win the Hawkeye 10 Conference, and it starts, you know, one game at a time. Now all of a sudden we're going to turn our focus to TJ on Monday, and we're going to really buy in and you know look at the scout, watch the film, and dive into that. But you know it's it's those small little stages that you go through, and just really embracing the process of developing yourself and developing your team. So I you know state tournament obviously is everybody's goal, but you know it's going to be one game at a time for us. 
Thanks, Coach. Congrats. Thank you, Coach.